Patricia is on a world tour right now with her husband Garth Brooks and sang the national anthem beautifully mm -hmm. at the Predators hockey playoff game. Um, and this all happened, by the way, Tricia, as news of the Manchester bombing was was just, kind of unfolding. Just unfolding yeah. So when you were when you were at the event last night, it was just sort of happening. Yeah, we were we were just about to go out and sing, and there was like like you know. Things are, social media is kind of saying something's going on, something happened, yeah. but we really didn't know um, any details. It, it seemed like it took a while for yeah. the details to kind of come out. Even this morning, I feel like I was learning you know, new things. Hour. But every time you sing the national anthem, I always think about, especially in this day and time, I think about, um, I, it, you know, when I, when you, for me, the, we were talking before we yeah. came on, you were talking about our flag was still there. I always get really tingly all over when I sing um, Land of the Free, you know. It's the first, Yeah, right? it is. It's very I mean, to hear everybody in there singing was mm. really amazing, really uh, powerful. As a performer, um, we were thinking about Ariana Grande and having this big, beautiful concert that's happening. You and made it, all those people happy. Yeah. 21,000 um, people happy. Does this sort of thing ever cross your mind when you, and when you're performing or when you're performing with your husband? Um, yes and no. You know, mm -hmm. I mean, I think that in this day and age, you don't do anything without considering that we live in a different world. We you sure know? do. Um, but you also, it's that whole thing. I know every time something like this happens, everybody says, you know, you've got to live your life and you can't. Can't, can't let them win. Right, exactly. Yeah. That's the thing that you always say. But there is a truth in that you, we, everybody takes everything's more safe everything is more precautions yeah. are taken but you still there's still a risk every time you go out the door absolutely yeah. so you have to go i think music is that place where it is a healer it is the place that people go to escape the things in their mm -hmm. life that yes. they want to get away from and that's what makes me the saddest is especially with ariana grande with these little girls yeah. who just want to go hear her sing and they're just in there having the time of their lives and you know trying to you know just have fun what are you saying when you hear something like this what do you and your friends talk about are you and your husband like what what is the conversation? I think we just, I, I, I know it's happening often enough that it almost becomes where you don't, you're not surprised by it, yeah. but we need to still be completely yeah. surprised and devastated mm -hmm. every time something like this yeah. happens because I don't want it to be like, oh, well, there, there's another one. It needs yeah. to be each, every person who lost somebody, this is, this is everything that's yeah, happening the in our lives right now world, so yeah. I'm, I'm frustrated and I'm I'm sad mm -hmm. and I and I'm, I'm sad for the families and the victims I'm also sad for Ariana because I even though it has no yeah. bearing on her it's still got to be devastating sure yeah well sure. she has canceled apparently some some of her some tour of her, yeah some of yeah her and overseas. that makes sense wouldn't yeah. you think of course absolutely yeah. I hope she doesn't feel responsible in any way because no. she she no. isn't no, no she isn't yeah um we're just watching you sing the anthem and we should we kind of touched on it but Hooray for Nashville for for, yeah. for getting to this point in the Stanley Cup. When you say that, that the place is a buzz, like oh, describe what you're crazy. talking about. Nashville is a great community yeah. for really getting behind their their athletic programs. You know, we we didn't really have anything. We had the Nashville Sounds, a, a Triple A baseball team, and then when we got the Titans, Nashville really rallied yeah. around. And, and we do want everybody to know that there's big news in your life as well <laughs> because of your um, the new mm. deal that you have going with your cookware and your cooking and all you're of that. You're very busy. Can everybody find out more about all that on your yeah. website yeah yeah okay course. we just felt like today was maybe not the day yeah, to talk that's about what we it. said before I'm like I I feel I don't really feel like talking about hey this is what you should go out and do mm, I, yeah. I, I think this is a, a day of, um, of of respect and and we're close to Memorial Day so it makes sense to kind of be talking about the anthem and talking about our celebrating yeah. our veterans I mean everybody will be getting together next weekend and that's always good because I think I, I saw something Justin Timberlake posted like we need to do better we, we need to love one another I say love one another every night at the end of my show yeah. and I feel like that's like especially this week you know just a chance to just yeah you know yeah. be with your people well if you want to feel better go on YouTube listen to Trisha sing the national anthem last night it's where it'll be so or, or, or listen to Trisha yeah. sing anything <laughs> no, that'll work too oh, <laughs> we love you. Thank, you. thank you so thank you. much hello today fans thanks for checking out our YouTube channel subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews show highlights and digital exclusives